Okay, I'm back on the final video here for A squared. Uh, wait, not final. Second to final, I think. <clears throat> it's uh, picking up some things that it deleted. That's Windows saying, I can't find this malware. Where is it, <laughs> basically? Uh, what we're going to go ahead and test is uh, Internet Explorer. Again, why am I using Internet Explorer? It's the worst of the worst. So let's make sure the worst of the worst works just fine, and that way we know everything else worked fine. This is Internet Explorer 6. Nothing can be worse. So I know this page is definitely malicious. Let's see if A squared can take care of it. It should kick me out or something, right? Cool. Uh, it didn't load. It, it always loads. So um, I would have liked to seen like an A squared alert, but it didn't load. Let's try it again. loading. Alright. Let's go ahead and reset our uh, home page to just Google. Okay, so it says alert. Program tried to change browser settings. Uh, and then it gives you this uh, suggestion. 51% of the people allowed it, 9% unsure, 30% denied. I am. I know I'm doing this, so I'm just going to go ahead and allow it. Close this, open it back up, and um, we have another alert. It says uh, Internet Explorer, iExplorer.exe. Trying to see what it's really bitching about. Uh, I guess for now I'm just going to go ahead and allow it. I don't really see any kind of concrete threat. So Google comes up just fine. I'm going to do a search for uh, hijack, not hijack this, combo fix. An often hijacked alert, or hijacked uh, query. Mm. Site loads just fine. Uh, A squared is blocking some ad stuff. I don't really care about that. That's nice to know, though. Um... I'll do a search for um, antivirus. And a lot of these paid listings, uh, I don't, a lot of these paid listings have come up uh, uh, as a lot of malware recently. A lot of uh, 2008 and 2009 um, XP antiviruses. So you've got to be kind of careful on some of these listings. AVG loads fine. I mean, browsing is just totally normal at this point. Um, I don't have any kind of problem at all. The system's very quick. Uh, we're going to look at RAM here in a second. What's A squared using on this box? The browser seems to be totally clean. I can go anywhere I want. I know I have a messed up host file, so I don't know if Symantex can load. Uh, let's like try Clam Antivirus. Yeah. Download.com. Yeah, website loads completely. No more pop-ups. No more anything bothering me. Okay, let's look at the RAM stuff real quick. Everyone's always messaging me, telling me that their antivirus uses so much RAM and such, and I don't know what to tell you except that a lot of programs use a lot of RAM these days. Um, and really, I could care less because most machines come with 3-4 gigs of RAM. When someone buys a new machine, it's, it's almost always like that. Uh, so, anyway, A squared is using quite a bit. The A2 service is using 90 megs. 
the A2 guard is using 20 megs. And I'm not sure if there's any other A's now. That's it. But you know what? The PC is quick and nimble. I have 225 megs left over, and I'm able to do whatever I want. PC's not bogged down at all. Menu's open pretty much right away. Okay, um, I'm going to go back inside uh, A squared really quick and see if there's anything else that I missed. Because the next step, uh, I'm going to be collecting my uh, hijack this log, and we're going to do a super anti-spyware scan and see if we missed anything. Um, but I also have to talk about one little awesome application with A squared, and that's hijack free. I love this thing. Um, Hang on a second, I'm going to pause the video real quick. Okay. Uh, I had someone call me, sorry. Uh, hijack Free is awesome. It gives you running processes, open ports, anything starting up uh, in your computer. So registry, startup files, auto start, uh, tricky startups. Shows you all your services. And then it's got a bunch of other stuff that uh, an advanced user will love, like ActiveX controls, hosts, LSP protocols, and Explorer add-ons. Just awesome. I love that little application. So anyway, if I go into Processes, I can usually recognize a malware process pretty easily. And on my last review, well the, the, on the initial review, uh, pre-review, I had some leftover malware. This time I have none. Uh, so A squared has just booted it. I uh, wish I could have had some to show you, but what you can do is you can basically, you know, delete file, delete references, save a backup of the file, and then kill that process. Awesome, awesome, awesome. It's just a a file assassin. So, uh, and then I've got a bunch of auto run stuff here. Um, old things that used to be uh, malware that are actually gone but the auto run is still there I can just uh, deselect a bunch of these turn off a stupid messenger it's just so um, so awesome I just love that I'm probably not hitting apply or something, but that's because I haven't used it yet. Um, I guess maybe I have to hit enable or something. I don't know. I, I could figure it out, but I guess it's not that big of a deal right now. But anyway, that's just part of the A squared uh, suite. It's like a little separate application. So I'm going to go ahead and... Um, Go on to the next video, which would be the super anti-spyware scan, and uh, the hijack this log. Be right back.